Hello and welcome back to RC Model Reviews. Something arrived on my bench this morning. It's this, it's the TBS Cape Pre... One of these. Oh, what is with these names? Goodness me. I mean, it's a brilliant looking product. I love it, but oh, could they have come up with a better name? Cape Breena. Cape, Cape Breena. Yeah, Cape Breena. Why don't they just call it the black flying wing or something? I mean, <laughs> goodness me. Um, English words are so much easier for those of us who don't speak foreign languages. But anyway, it's the mini FPV wing. And they've sent it to me for review. Had to pay a hundred and something bucks GST on it because it's not a cheap model. These aren't cheap, but hey, I really like it. One of the good, good things I really like about this is the size. It's small, which is really good from a couple of perspectives. First of all, I can throw it in the back of the two-door Honda without any difficulty at all without pulling it down. And also because it's small and it's light, it's not a danger to anyone. If anyone bitches and grizzles and moans about someone flying this, then oh, they really do need to get a life because ugh, it's light, it's EPO, and it's small. They're probably not even gonna notice it's black. It's a stealth FPV model. So anyway, that's gonna to go together pretty soon. I'm not doing an unboxing, just, just to give you an idea of the size. And You'll find out lots more information on this on the Team Black Sheep website. I'll put that in the description below. And also go and look at their YouTube channel. What is it? Nast Nasty Cop 420. There's so much really good FPV footage on there. It's brilliant. If you've ever thought, mm, maybe I'll get into FPV, and you haven't seen the Team Black Sheep YouTube channel, go and have a look, and then that'll make your mind up for you. You'll be really keen to get into it. And I must admit, they're doing some really good stuff. It's really excellent. Uh, as I say, I reviewed their little plug-in receiver for the... Fat Shark Dominators, that lets you use the cheap 200 milliwatt and 400 milliwatt, 600 milliwatt transmitters, and that's brilliant. I use it all the time, it's excellent. So yeah, they have some really good stuff there worth looking at, that's for sure. I'll do a full review on this, a full build video too, to go with the other build videos that are going on over there, and then we'll be all, you'll be flooded with build videos all at once, and you'll say stop, stop, no more. Now just to let you know also that I have to move house. My, the house that we rent, can only afford a rented house. The house that we're renting has been sold, so we're gonna move out in the next couple of weeks and got another place lined up. But, oh, we're gonna move furniture and bedding and the freezer and all that stuff. Oh, and I'm an old, I'm an old guy, past my prime. It's not really, uh, the truck's broken, so it's a bit of a nightmare organizing, moving all that big heavy furniture and getting a new internet connection set up, all that sort of stuff, but, oh, has to be done. But it means that I may have to basically stop what I'm doing here for a little while and get that out of the way so I can get on. The Free Sky Tyrannus. Yes, I've got that all set up on the bench at home to do the latency tests and that sort of stuff. I better do it before we move because I don't want to have to pull it all down and then put it back up again in a new place. So that's what I'll be trying to do this afternoon and get that video sorted out, upload it in the next few days, which includes, of course, the uh, uh, latency test of some of the other radios out there too, such as the Turnergy 9X and maybe even the Aurora A9. Who knows? So we'll be comparing all those radios, looking at the latency, and see what we can find out about that. So there you go, I haven't been sleeping, I haven't been wasting my time, I have been very busy, but I just thought this was really good. I'd give, you, give it a mention so you know what's coming up. And my goodness, there's gonna be so much FPV action going on here very shortly that you'll get so tired of it, you'll tell me to do something else. But that's it, another video from RC Model Reviews, just a little catch up, a little not so weekly, weekly news, and I'll see you again very, very soon.